Hi everyone, in this video is a quick one to, it's a challenge, challenge which I'm sending out to all of you. What I've done is I've gone and put a couple of photos uh, which I took today or in and around Edinburgh. Um, HDR photos, so I took an underexposed, a middle exposed and an overexposed shot uh, at certain places around here. And uh, my challenge to you guys is to edit these, if you've got Photoshop, edit these so that they are what you think the best HDR files that you can make. Uh, my idea at the moment is that Photoshop absolutely sucks at doing HDR. I've been bringing them in, I've been using Photoshop all day today, and I'm just thinking, it just, it just doesn't really get it. Uh, so this is my challenge to you. Uh, if you want to find all the photos, I've put them into a Dropbox. Uh, the link is on the Don Bauer photography page. Uh, I've put them on both pages, you can get it there. Um, but if you can, if you can do a video, if, if you could do a video of how you edit it, uh, edit the images and stuff like that, that would be awesome. I'd be interested to see that. And I'll put the links to your videos in the description box of this uh, video as well. Um, but my kind of impression at the moment is that Photoshop and HDR don't really go very well together. And the amount of information you can get just from editing in Lightroom you don't really need HDR. Certainly not with the shots which I've done, which I'll, so I'll do a video uh, in the future where I'm talking about how how you really don't need to do HDR, but just a good bit of editing. So uh, check the links down below. I'll put it in the description as well. Otherwise, they're on the photography pages on YouTube, on Facebook even. Hope it helps. Bye.